Hello everyone, Luke Full Smith here. Welcome to a November update of Chris Clan. Um, let's get through it. It's the eleventh month of the um, of two thousand twenty-four, November twenty twenty-four. Highlights was on the first of November. Minecraft Exploring the End Realm is published. Chris's car is photographed at a Wendy's in Lanchburg. On the 2nd, po Chris posts more Kamara Harris drawings to Twitter. On the 4th, Chris implies that, that his Kamara Harris sign has either been dis dis de defaced or stolen. And Chris announces a live stream for the 5th of November for the election results. I bet you he was pissed off with the results of that. <laughs> 5th of November, Minecraft God Dialogue read, read is published. The election for the President of the United States of America occurs. Chris records Jesus Christ can reacting to the presidential elections 2024. A live stream reacting to the election results, although he stops before the winner is declared. <laughs> what, a, what an idiot. He, he couldn't make it to the end. Later, Kamara Harris, who Chris has voted for, is defeated by Donald Trump. That was a waste of a vote, wasn't it? <laughs> on the 6th of November, Chris makes a post on Blue Sky claiming that he is making further, uh, further making the move to the platform. Blue Sky is a left-wing version of Twitter slash X, but... Blue Sky is full of paedophiles, so, um, left, left ringers, eh? <laughs> Official CWC Mart is updated with multiple artworks, the fifth panel to Act 4 of the Chaos Crystal Control, portal workings from the 2021 Lost Commissions, and I had returned home from the official CWC Mart Gale Art. So he's uploaded some stuff to his Quickie Mart. On the 7th of November, Chris blocks Caitlyn Jenner's Twitter account over the latter support of Trump or PMERT. As I think, it's like, Caitlyn Jenner is a big, like, right-wing Trump supporter, so, um, of course Chris, Chris hates her. Even though Caitlyn is, is meant to be trans and um, Chris is meant to enjoy liking trans people but apparently not her because <laughs> she's a Trump supporter um, on the 9th Chris makes his first insightful post on Blue Sky and announces his plan to switch to the platform in a Twitter post on the 11th Chris announces a new CWC Lite exclusive Rose Clue medallions for sale Chris posts Blake Sonicu and a few previously unanswered questions on Quicklight. On the 16th of November, Chris posts Ultra Sonicu to Quicklight. Quicklight is basically his own website and selling page, a bit like the Lamar, um, but different. It's personal blog, in other words. On the 21st, Chris removes the Blue Heart from the CPU Blue Heart to add on B-Sky or to add on the butterfly to B-Sky at the end of his profile name on Twitter he also adds a link to his Blue Sky ac account to uh, in his bio Chris enters a competition for a chance to have his OC Nightstar turned into a plush product sold, sold by U2s on the 23rd of November Chris records Jesus Christ Clan Shadow Generations Speedrun, a live stream. A comment made by, by Chris in response to a ween asking, asking him about children stirred up a speculation of whenever Chris was having or planning to have a child soon. We'll get to that in a second. On the 25th of November, Chris reveals that his Lynchburg PO box has been closed due to a mis miscommunication. In others, too much spam been sent and the post office just couldn't take it anymore so they just closed it he said that the mail should be sent to 14 Bank Court instead 
So so Barb will have to deal with that then, I guess. Which, um, she is still alive. As I, there's no saying that she's dead yet, but she's very much alive from what I understand. On the 27th of November, Chris puts an end to a viral false pregnancy rumour that spread online in his recent stream by making a statement. Again, we'll get to that in a minute. Light Power CWC Reviews Bumba Lumba is set to private and re-uploaded to Chris's YouTube channel again. 28th, Thanksgiving. Don't know what happened on Thanksgiving, just Thanksgiving. And Sun Ku Reviews Skit Redux is published to Chris's YouTube channel. So that's everything they've done. Um, chats, none. Posts, we, we're not... His... Posts on social media takes so long to do, so I'm not even going to bother. Um, the videos he done was the Minecraft Explore in the End Realm, Minecraft God Dialogue Read, Chris Christ, Jesus Christ Can Reacting to the ele Presidential Elections 2024, Jesus Christ Can Shadow Generation Speedrun. Um, let's have a look at his sightings. Only one in November. On the 1st of November, Reddit user... 1364 took a picture of Chris's car and then posted it and then posted that they were behind Chris at a drive through in Virginia later claiming it to be a Renders in Lynchburg let's have a little look yes that's his car alright Virginia is for lovers you can interpret that how you want <laughs> oh dear um, so yeah, this was last updated yesterday. It's the thirtieth of today. Um, so let's talk about the um, the um, oh yeah, base yeah. Let me just let me just bring this up. M might as well. So let's talk about his pregnancy rumours. Yes, there was a comment, well a a chat um, donation uh, that popped up, basically asking. Um, when's the baby arriving? They're basically a troll because obviously random to to, to tell that. Then Chris Chris says, "Yeah, it will come eventually, and it will be announced soon or whenever the baby comes," implying that Flutter Flutter was pregnant. So everybody started like panic online it's like chris can't have a baby he, he cannot look after a baby it, it should be taken away from him which is true it should he is so incapable of looking after a baby he he, he can't even look after himself so yeah um yeah there was a lot of speculation that oh is it true is it not um personally me and a few other other people um roguely Vogue the internet man as well he he even said it first of all he came out with a fact about Chris which everybody knew Chris is known to lie he is known to be a notorious liar and um, lo and behold uh, a few days afterwards in a Twitter or Blue Sky post or I think it was Facebook as well Chris announced that it was a lie to basically felt the trolls and everyone was like, "Oh, thank God for that!" It's like everyone was so relieved, in, inclu including me, that that the, a, a baby, the the Antichrist, w w w was not real, and Chris was only like pulling our legs um, afterwards because, yeah, can you imagine Chris can with a baby? It'll be a nightmare. That that kid will be taken away on day one. So like he cannot even look after a living thing. He he abuses and ne neglects his dogs. He rapes his own mother. He gets into trouble so many times. So of course he is incapable of looking after a child. And another factor is again what 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 the internet man um c come up. Um, Chris took um drugs, medication like hormone therapy. And obviously that sort of stuff messes up with your reproductive system. It, it kills the sperm cells, in, in, in other words. If you're a man trying to transition into a woman, obviously you don't need, don't need your dick and balls to work anymore. So you just take, take a load of drugs to, to, um, to um, get, get your bristles to, to get, get bigger. And obviously 
stuff in, in the drugs that you take, the estrogen and stuff, kills off your, your sperm cells. So, of course, Chris wouldn't be able to conceive anyway because no seeds in there. It's like nothing. So, thankfully, <laughs> the, it, it, it was a lie. Chris is not going to be having kids anytime soon. He won't even be able to adopt either because of his because of his um his criminal record well his spat in in prisons and everything and in order to adopt you got to have people come to your house make sure it's safe for, for a child they'll check on you like for about six months to a year i, I don't know how the um, adoption process goes on nowadays but you need to be checked you need to be vet vetted in order to in order to adopt a child um because obviously you don't want any rando to look after anyone's kid because just in case they you start abusing it or sexually assaulting it or killing it so you 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 gotta be you gotta be strict you gotta be like safe with kids so that's why the adoption services have to send people out to check on you and chris is not c compatible with looking after kids we all know that so um so yes that has been it for today's video uh, the last one of the year will obviously be the end of next month um it's gonna be a bit of a nightmare to get the videos out at, at the end of the month at end of next month but i'm gonna try my best this is gonna go up tonight i'm gonna record a review for tomorrow afternoon um so hopefully you've enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys next time